And then there's this, the surreal images from Fort McMurray ravaged by another fire in 2016, where the flames this week turned the sky red. Look at that. That must be terrifying for the people that had already gone through so much in 2016 and had only minutes to evacuate. Apocalyptic scenes in West Kelowna tonight where a state of emergency has been declared. So this is one of 250 fires within the Northwest Territories and more than a thousand across Canada. We know they have had an unprecedented season, but this graphic that we're about to show you really puts it into perspective. This is all of the acreage burned to date. Look at 2023, nearly doubling their worst in the last 40 years of history. And so 600% of normal to date, an incredible one. Wow, that graph really just unprecedented there. Ginger, thank you. Fires have been spreading across Canada's sparsely populated Northwest Territories for months now. But in recent days, they've started to threaten the territory's capital, Yellowknife. This is some of the imagery from the Yellowknife fire. Just look at the sky. Look at how close it is to that road. The cities of Kelowna and West Kelowna are now under a state of emergency after the blaze jumped the lake overnight. It's the latest development in an already record-breaking wildfire season that could get worse. I want to underscore that we are very concerned about the developing wildfire situation here in BC. A weather system is sweeping across all of BC, bringing strong winds, lightning, and no rain, exacerbating already dire drought conditions. It was like a hundred years of firefighting all at once in one night. I think this chart basically sums it up of what is happening this year. Those started really early and the pink line is our line from 2023 compared to all the years through back to 2000. And you can see that we're basically off the charts. The charts just keep having to grow to show this worst wildfire season on record. And we still have the rest of August and into September. It's not a good situation, isn't it? That graph is as stark as it gets, Bradman. Thank you. up there. Is that a fire in the trees right there? 